hiding in here. So let me see if I can get my camera in as close as I can because it's really hard to see. Can you see it in there? I, I don't know. There, there it is. Do you see it? There's tomatoes around it too. But I don't think it's ready to pick yet. So I have to ask my daddy bear when it's going to be ready to pick because I'm not sure. But the exciting news is coming in a minute after I walk over here. But look, the garden's getting so tall. And here is the exciting news. Our fruit vegetables. Can you believe it? We got cucumbers. Daddy Bear picked them last night. I don't even know where they came from. Somewhere in here, because it's such a jungle, I can't tell where everything is. But Daddy Bear picked them. And Mommy Bear helped me save some seeds from a couple of them. And we ate one last night. And it was so delicious. Fresh cucumber from the garden. Yum, yum, yum. I'm going to show you in a couple minutes how we saved the seeds. But let me go on the other side of the garden and check how that's doing. So hold on a minute. On my way over to the other side, I noticed some butternut squash in there. I think there's a little one over here too. Where did I see it? Uh, where'd it go? There it is. Can you see it? It's in there. Right? Right there. I think so. Yeah. So, lots of butternut squash growing in here too. I can't wait. We use that to make pumpkin pie. Instead of pumpkin pie, it's squash pie. Hee <laughs> hee. Okay. Now on my way to the other side of the garden. Hold on. Okay, here's the other side of the garden. Wow, there's so many flowers on this side. I'm so excited. Hopefully, we'll get lots of good vegetables from all those flowers. There sure are some tall things in here. I'm not quite sure what they are. I hope they're vegetables. <laughs> this pepper plant looks like it's doing well. Look, there's some good flowers on it. I can't wait to get some peppers. We make pepper soup out of it. Maybe we'll have to share the recipe with you sometime. One time, Mommy Bear was at, at a church. Oh, I see a squash in there. You see it? It's, it's over here. Right there. So anyway, my Mommy Bear was at a, a church and it said pepper soup on the sign. And Mommy Bear was like, pepper soup? What in the world is pepper soup? She was thinking that it was like pepper, like, you know, this spicy pepper. But no, it was using peppers. And she tried it, and she liked it, and so she makes it. So maybe we'll share the recipe with you sometime. So, okay, well, let me go head over to the back garden and see how that's doing. So hold on. <sighs> Well, Mr. Groundhog decided to eat off all my broccoli plant leaves. Shoot them all off. I didn't get any fence or anything, so I don't think I'm going to get any broccoli. But I think we'll get some tomatoes, hopefully. There's quite a few flowers. And I'm pretty sure we'll get some peppers, too. I think here's a pepper plant. There's some flowers growing on it. So, I think we're going to get some. And I see some tomatoes over there. Yeah, Daddy Bear didn't get the hole filled in from Mr. Groundhog yet. So, he was having a feast on my broccoli leaves. Look, I think pretty soon we're going to be able to harvest a ripe tomato. Look, it's getting ripe. I don't know. I can't wait till we get the tomatoes. Tomatoes are so delicious. I love them so much. Do you like tomatoes? Oh look, here's another couple flowers from the pepper plants. So, they're doing pretty well. Let me come around the other side here to see if those bigger tomatoes are growing. Because big tomatoes I make tomato sandwiches with. Do you like tomato sandwiches? I love tomato sandwiches. Wow. They're 
growing. Look how many there are. Oh boy. And there's some small ones and there's some small ones. We're going to have pretty good tomatoes. I think this is the only big tomato plant over on this side. It looks like everything else is cherry tomatoes. Oh well. Hopefully this one plant will give us lots of good tomatoes. This was my first year growing a lot of them all from seed. So it was quite a learning experience. So next year I hope to have some more big tomatoes. And that one on the end, I don't know what's going on. The leaves are turning all yellow. I think Daddy Bear didn't get the mulch put away. And it might be holding too much water for that plant there. I think that might be what's going on. So, I'm not sure. Okay, well, thank you so much for watching. Oh, wait, I forgot to show you how we saved the cucumber seeds. Okay, hold on. On my way in, I noticed some strawberries to pick. So I picked them before the birdies decided to eat them. So, anyway, here are the cucumber seeds. Mommy Bear helped me pick them, and you put them into water. And then the ones that float to the top, you just discard because you dump them out because they won't grow. They're not any good. And you let them soak for a couple days to get all the yucky stuff off from the cucumber gunk. And then you dump the, the stuff that floats to the top off. And then you dry them on a plate. So, I'll show you that part once we dump it out and dry them on a plate. And you also have to keep them away from where the mice could come because mice like to eat seeds. So if you have any mice in your house, you might want to keep your seeds in a safe place. Okay, well, thank you so much for watching. I'm going to go and eat one of my strawberries now.